Konnichiwa, and welcome back to another video, because today there's been a new update, kind of a surprise one, I mean, I, I wasn't expecting it to say the least, I mean the last one with the ravine, that was a surprise one, but, um, it appears to be a Japanese, or at least, um, um, East Asian themed update, cause I mean, we, look at Sushi Bento, new Benjamin skin, um, a sword, sword hero, um, Sato, Sauda? What, I, I don't know. Um, um, Blossom's Cherry Tree, and inner and a new map called Inner Peace. That'll be interesting. A new trophy store item. I actually haven't seen those. I've only played two games today, and none and neither of them were with Sauda or on this new map. I haven't even unlocked it yet. But let's let's look at these trophy store items real quick, just before we do anything else. Wow. So, okay, so this is like, so this is like Easter. Yeah, well, I guess that makes sense. Benjamin Matrix Kung Fu. Wow. That, if I actually had <gasps> Ninja Kiwi Pet. Oh. <laughs> well, I know what I'm getting next. Dancing Monkey. An emote. <gasps> Wait, the Dance Monkey song that used to be, that was my favorite song when it came out. Attack Monkey Avatar, Powerful Sentai, Avatar Winner by- Oh, they had like an art contest. I'm going a little too fast, but... Wow. Ooh, Dartling Easter Eggs. Yes. Oof, what should I get? Bunny Ear Balloons? Nah. BFB, I don't have enough. I'm thinking just getting the Dartling Easter Eggs. Mm, but the dance way. Blooming Flowers emote. Ooh, Flowers Pop Effects. I can't, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I, I think I'm just gonna, like, turn off my pop effects because I've found that, um, um, that's, that in, like, um, when there's a lot of balloons, it can really slow down your computer. Um, hmm, there, there aren't any new, oh, well, there's the chocolate mob and the chocolate BFB. They, I think, they need to add another bad or zombie, or... I think they need to add another batter um, DDT skin because they just those really don't have anything else. Um, I don't have. I think yeah, why not? Let let me just get the um darling Easter eggs. Okay, that's on. Okay, so now let's look at this new hero, Sada Sada, whatever her name is. Oh, yeah, I don't know, um, but whatever, let's look. So this is Sauda, the sword master. Um, I also suppose that this is basically a free thumbnail when the new hero comes out, because then you just screenshot it. Um, leaping sword attack, dramatic leap attack targets the strongest balloon on screen. So this is like a melee monkey, right? Well, I mean, this will be all the monkey money that I, um, <laughs> that I spent a while saving up for, but I guess. My blade's legendary! My blade- did, did everyone hear that? She's, like, British? I can't tell. Whatever. Screenshot. Yay, thumbnail. Okay. That was cool. Um, my blades are legendary. So what is her- Let's just select open. And then what's her, like, voice like? Hold on. Admiral on deck. She British. My blade's a legendary. The sun god fights on the side with the best artillery. I don't know. I, I can't place that accent, but whatever. Selected. Legendary. Um, only six hundred. Okay, so that that immediately sets like an early game thing. Slashes with both swords at nearby balloons. So like a melee monkey, like Pat, but she has a weapon, so maybe her range is gonna be a little bigger. Pops more balloons, leaping sword attack, whatever. We'll figure it out when we play. So it charge leaps. Oh, she like glide. Mm. I wonder what sort of dynamic it's gonna bring. So there's Sada. Oof. I don't know why, but sometimes OBS randomly like dies in terms of frame rate just every so often, and I don't know why, but whatever. Also. 
Um, before we do anything, I just want to say that thank you all so much for 20 subscribers and also for my last video, which has hit almost 800 views at the time of recording. That's insane. I don't know how many likes there is, but whatever. Like, if you enjoy that kind of content, just please keep it up. I mean, that's like... That's crazy. I mean, at most, I've been getting like... 20 views on average per video, and I had one video that hit 300 just recently, but that's crazy. I thank you so much. And please subscribe, because I have to plug my channel. It's a rule among YouTubers. Okay. So, do we do it on the new map? I mean, they make it hard to, like, boost, I think, because of how it looks. Looks a lot. Very complicated, but I guess it's worth a try, right? Balance. Um... Let's just do medium, because I don't want to, like, lose instantly. Oop, loading. Okay, so... Wait, she's only 540 on medium. Oh, that's because of, like, monkey knowledge I would do. Whoa! Not a water here, that'd be funny. I mean... I've seen... I've seen the beginning of one YouTube video on this. I don't know, this is a pretty good spot. I think... What? What on earth? Are, are they... Do they go along all these paths? Um, okay, I guess put her right there. Still don't know the accent. Um, she's got a good range. I guess let's just play it around and see how it, how it goes. What? Okay, that's cool. I like that. Yeah, that's cool. That, like, slicing thing? Yeah, I mean... That's cool. Yeah, so, okay. So this is definitely a good spot to put her, so... So it looks like she hits some once, and then she follows up with her other sword. In, like, one direction. But she spins really quickly. Okay, so... Her first level pops my balloons. Dramatic leap attack. Okay, so let's try this. Um, balloons, and let's wait for the blue balloons to get here. Whoa! Okay, that was cool. That was cool. Okay, so that's probably more of a single target attack. I can't really tell because the balloons are so spread out on this map. Mm, do we keep going with this map? Like, where do we put things? Oh, there's a fair amount of spots. Oof, all these. Hmm. Yeah. And I guess they're pro I guess you can probably put things. Yeah, you can. So there'll be space for farms. I guess, yeah. We can keep on this map. So how long does she go without any help? That's my curiosity. I think I'll, I'll just farm for a little bit. And see how far she goes. Um, okay. Put down first farm. There's not a lot of space on this map, so we're probably going to want to go banks. Um, sometimes, um, I like to do marketplace spam, because it's really good, but it does take up a lot of space. Which I don't really think we have on this map. Man, she's just demolishing. Turn on auto start. And I guess we'll just keep going until we see how far she can actually go on her own. I mean, holy skit, she attacks super fast. Like, are we seeing this right now? Like, this is like... Ninja type speeds. Okay. While we're doing this, let me upgrade this to increase production. And does she, like, boost things? That's my curious thing. Oh, wait. Um, so there's two layers. Attacks faster. Increased range and popping power. Nice. Praise on Bloom's weakness. Doing extra damage if they're stunned and can pop. Okay. Pretty good. Attacks even faster. Not sure. Balloon bleed. Pops through three layers of with each strike and causes a slow damage. Okay. Um. Wow. Okay, so I I don't know. This is this is some interesting stuff. Sword charge, yeah, we saw that. So that inflicts extra damage to any balloon slowed immobilized or taking damage over time from other monkeys. Okay, so she She's like a supporting thing, like she, like, like she, well, she preys on their weaknesses, I guess. Leaping sword increases power. 
Enchanted Blades do more damage and allow Sada to damage all balloons? Okay, that's good. Well, by that time, you probably can hit everything anyway, but still, that's pretty good. Um, also, she leveled up pretty slowly, to be honest. Attacks even faster, increased range, more power, balloon bleed deals more damage, sword charge greatly increased damage, slice through many blue layers at once. Um, thanks for the description, Ninja Kiwi, that's basically worthless. Sada's swords attack with a blur of speed. What does that even mean? I assume that increases attack speed. Enchanted Blades do extra damage to regrow, fortified, and camo blades. Oh, at 19 against DDTs, that's gonna be really good. I'm predicting that's a DDT killer. Sword Charge sweeps all path three times. Yeah, don't know what that is yet, but... So... So she's like a... I don't know. I don't know yet, but that's some... That's a, a lot of, like, personality traits there. Like in her attack. Shing, 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 shing. You know that meme where that one kid is screaming like, Shing, shing! Yeah. Although, to be honest, that is pretty annoying. Just a constant. In the later rounds, when she's, like, constantly attacking balloons, it's gonna be really annoying. Um, so long life, and then valuable. So what if I just... <sighs> yeah, I don't know how- I still don't know how much damage, because we haven't encountered any real strong ones. Um... Yeah, yeah. Um... So this map- is this- wait, is this not water? What? That's... Only this- okay, that's kind of BS. Like, what? Here, sword charge. Also, she moves extremely fast. Like, that was like a split second. Like, I'll wait for it to recharge, and then, like, this is- this is in real time. What? <laughs> like, she's like, the speediest of the speedy. Um, but yeah, I mean, why, why isn't this water, mm, that's, that's stupid, because then you can put land towers everywhere, and it doesn't change it at all, like, because it's supposed to be, like, y yin yang, so land and water, I, I don't like that. Mm. Hui, shink, these swords, oh no, they're just for decoration. I just keep, I guess, just keep farming, but this is a pretty interesting hero so far. Okay, so we've got our first monkey bank. Wait, she... Did it... Did, is it... Yeah, no, she's the only tower I have. Did she just pop that camo bloom? Hold up, where did it say she has camo blooms? So it attacks faster. So that's with those swords. Pops more blooms per attack. Increases... Yeah, she's at level 5. So it attacks faster. Slides through two layers of blooms. Dramatic Leap Attack. Does she have default camo? I mean, I guess that's sort of- No, that doesn't even make sense. Also, she deals two layers of damage now. That's pretty cool. She's like a sword person. Like, how, how does she have camo? Um, I... Just that alone is mildly overpowered. Also, we still haven't lost any lives yet. Um, wow. In default camo. I think Ninja Kiwi is giving too many things camo. Like, it shouldn't be this easy to get camo. I mean, th in BTD5, getting camouflage detection was actually kind of hard. Like it was like it was something you actually had to think about. Now, usually, usually it's pretty easy to have camo by the time. Yeah, no way she had sleds. Nope. Okay. So, what do we do here? Um, Alchemist? Sure, Alk. Alchemist. Oh, the leads are blocking everything. How many times do the balloons go around there? Okay. So, just her and an Alchemist just to pop leads. No, wait. Yeah, yeah, no, we'll keep the Alchemist. No, wait, yeah, no, no. Put the Alchemist right here. Just her and an Alchemist, and we'll see how long this can last. So, she can't pop lead by default, which makes sense. But, yeah. Okay, so two things. One, we got her balloons on weaknesses things, doing extra damage if they're stunned. Useless, because we don't have anything to stun them, or free them, but still. Um, and we're also going to get our second bank now, 
So let's just deposit some in there. And she's like a wing shredder. Like, this... I think she's a little bit overpowered, because... $540, and she's just soloing past 34. I mean... Literally, I don't know. I, I don't... Quincy... Quincy can't do that. Maybe maybe she's supposed to be just an early game hero and she just and she's complete trash late game, but right now this is a little bit like look at this, she just took out all of that Wait, what? Medium difficulty. Out of curiosity, we just go home. What sorts of a map is this? This is a Okay, it's an intermediate map. Okay, I, for some reason I thought it was an advanced map, but so I guess the balloons do go around here a couple of times, so that's why she could kill them so easily. Still. Like, look at all these rainbows. Just demolished for $540. That's pretty crazy. Here, what if she jumps? Cool. I, yeah, I don't know. This, this hero is a little bit questionable. <laughs> Okay, so we just lost so we just lost her first life, one pink bloom. She she lost one pink bloom. And from from zero to thirty-eight, one pink bloom for five hundred and forty dollars. Okay, and an alchemist. But still, that's still pretty quick, right? If she solos the Moab, I'm gonna lose it. Oh wait, it's still thirty nine. Okay, still. She solos the Moab. I'm not even gonna put down my free dart monkey. What happened to my headphones? Okay, there we go. I need new headphones. Um, but... Oh my gosh, no way. Look, these are regions, no way. Okay. Big blue. Moab. No way she sold it. Ability? How much damage did that do? Holy crust! No, no way. Okay. Yeah, so that didn't happen. Wait a minute. Wow. Wow. That was like... Okay, we lost 20 lives, but that's still pretty crazy. And, okay. Yeah, no, I'm gonna keep going. I'm, I'm gonna keep farming. I'm just gonna keep going until until we actually are at risk of actually losing Lulu. Dang, she is just destroying everything. This is just... This is not even... This is not okay. She's bullying those poor balloons. Like, she's just, like, massacring them. They're just wandering toward her, and she's just brutalizing it. At least, like, I don't know. Which is, look at this, no mercy. Attacking with the speed of light. No mercy. Um, no, I'm not even gonna buy any levels here. Jump. Oh, no mercy. Come on. Just, just... Yeah, no, she, she's got to lose here, right? Okay, a yellow balloon. Oh, okay, we're going to lose. So that happened. What round was that again? What round, what round was that? Um, 43, great. A $540 tower solos to round 43. I guess she's a hero. I guess that's fine. I don't know. I don't know, man. Collect, let's deposit again. Okay, so we have $23,000 because we just farmed. So, first things first, um, let's... Pops through three layers of balloons. I'm assuming she only pops pop through two before, so... Let's get that, that should help. Um, I guess let's elk buff, because why not? Um, yeah, let's go straight for that and let's get perishing potions. So now let's see, um, jump... Ching 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 ching. Wow, that was brutal. To think we almost lost there. Whoa, this balloon speed. Holy crust, that's brutal. Oh my gosh, look at she's leaving wounds. She's leaving wounds in the balloons. That rhymes. Oh, that's disgusting. Jeez. Ugh, she's ruthless. Ruthless, I tell you. Um, okay. So now that now that we've figured out how far she can go without 
without help. Now we need to give her help. Can you not put a village? Oh, I saw that. I saw that, Ninja Kiwi. Can't hide it. Where was it? Where was it? Come on. Oh, oh, oh. What? <laughs> right there. Yes. Okay. Uh, jungle drones. And then she has an elk buff, so we don't need to get Mon Monkey Intelligence Bureau. But I don't think Monkey Commerce affects heroes. Monkeys and upgrades tier three. Tier three, I yeah, I think. But P training is useless, so um let's go radar scanner. I mean that was still useless, I don't know why I spent that money, but um let's get another farm. Cause why not? It doesn't even matter. <laughs> it does, because we're gonna have to max her out at some point, but hey. I wanna see I'm curious about the sword charge. Um Although, it seems that she's less effective against single targets, definitely. She's more of an AoE tower. Um, let's deposit into this bank. Wait, no, we have to collect and deposit. Okay, if your banks are not in sequence, you're a monster. Like, not really, but like, I, I, I cannot have my banks out of sequence. I just don't like it. I, it hurts me. It hurts me to see it. Hmm. I, ooh, we can get an NG. How how much is overclock? Thirteen thousand. Okay. Well, after we collect from our banks, we can upgrade this NG. Oh yeah, no, this hedge you can't see it past the hedge, so we should be fine. Wait, what? What? Hello? Wait, but the but it doesn't wait. It doesn't affect balloons. Also, I'm lagging. Wait, did we just find a glitch already? In the first game on this map of the update. So he can shoot onto the track, but it doesn't affect balloons. I... Oh, oh, okay. I mean, this still makes a really annoying sound. I guess you do you, engineer. Um, wait, what if we get sentry? Yeah, no, it doesn't, it doesn't put it on the one side of the track. Oh, wait, we can go ahead and get overclocked. Great. Um, so why is it doing this? I just don't understand. Oh, another Moab. Well, now it's dead. Still cuts a tomato. Yeah, this is, this... I mean, she's just like in a frenzy. What if we overclock her? I'm gonna wait until the over. Look at—they don't even get to the circle if she's overclocked. She just demolishes them. Do we, I'm just gonna buy a sword charge because I'm impatient. Okay. Um, collect, deposit. Let's make all of the monies. So, what does this thing do? <gasps> what? Okay, so she just like clears the track. Um, got it. Cause that's definitely supposed to happen. Great. This is just great. Um, I I don't know what to say anymore. Do I dare? Do I dare get called to arms? I... Does she even need it? I don't even think she needs it. Gives us extra damage to, balloon, to any balloon slow to mobilize. Okay, so this alchemist or taking damage over time from other monkeys. Because this alchemist is also attacking, and the alchemist applies the acid effect, which is a damage over time thing, because it slowly dissolves them. She's... Just by this ha being in her presence, she's... Doing more damage. This is crazy. Overclock, cause again, cause why not? If things ever get, tr if we ever have trouble, whing! I'm glad it didn't insta kill the mobs, cause that'd just be broken. Um, side effects extra. Oh wait, no, she doesn't even have that yet. She doesn't even have the buff from this guy yet. 
like from the um, damage over time thing. Okay, let's over <laughs> again. We're not. We're never gonna be able to afford ultra boost, but that's fine. I, we're just gonna keep banking. But <laughs> this is crazy. Crazy man. What? I mean, these are like the basic buffs, and I, we because of the how this map works, we can't really temple buffer without the temple attacking everything. So I guess just get MIB. I don't know. Oh no. Oh no, we, we, we're in trouble. Oh no, guys, we're in trouble. What? Mm, um, I think, yeah, just... I think we'll get called to arms, because why not? A failsafe, you know? Why does she have an obsession with cutting tomatoes? I don't understand. Um... Here, call the arms. I don't think she's healthy. I think there's something... I, I think she's on steroids. I mean, how else does she attack this bad? Wow. Um, also... Yeah, this guy's still... In a... On affecting anything. Yeah, they're just walking right by it. Whatever. Here, let's just clean the track. Thank you. Oh, yeah, and also she has camo lead popping power. She does on her own, but... I I don't even need this, but yeah. Turn off auto start and see how fast she kills the BF. Oh wait, it's already off. And see how fast she kills the BFB. Um, do we want to go to 100? I think not. That'll be a different video. We need more content. Um, we don't have the sword charge ability. I I, but I'm fairly confident she won't need it. Let's jump on it first. Oh, that did, like, 20% of its health. Just by jumping on it. What? <sighs> eh, how much damage does this do? Oh, not much. Cool. So let's do that and that and then just eliminate. Well, 68,000 pops, not bad, not bad. Overall, um, I'm getting... I'm pretty... I'm feeling pretty good about this. Also, what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to um, put these banks back down. And I'm going to continue off here in a different video. And we're going to go to 100. Oh, come on, game. Don't tell me. Okay, fine. Fine, game. Be like that. Um, let's, yeah, let's do all this. And let's, so that we have an economy when we come back to this. Or, like, a way to make money, that is. I always brief it, um, by calling it economy or eco, but, yeah. <sighs> yeah, um, pretty, pretty good vibes from this hero. I mean, I like that she does a lot of damage to wounded balloons. Um, I think, I think that's, I think that's good, because I think without that she'd have a lot less strategical value. I, yeah, I'm liking this, I'm liking this update. Um... It's a very interesting map as well. It sort of seems to... You kind of want to have one tower because of, they all converge at one point. That's... You want to have one kind of AoE tower like this or attack shooter. And I actually think Pat Flossy wouldn't be very good because he's not like as much of an AoE as she is. Um, something like that. That's really good on this map. I also like that, like, they actually made a map that's, that is kind of designed for the hero. Like, not just in looks, but, like, strategically, that's really good for her. I, 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 I like that they did that. Because, like, when they added, when they added Entine, um, I, when I heard about the update, that's when I got the game, but when they added Entine, or Enton, whatever, whatever his name is, um, they didn't really add any, like, purpose-built maps that I know of for him. Um, yeah, so that's my first video on the update. Hope you enjoyed. Please like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.